and befuddled, stuck here, stuck! And my poor mother. Too still. Poor Cicero is stuck. Can't you see? I was transporting my dear, sweet mother. Well, not her. Her corpse. <laughs> She's quite dead. I'm taking mother to a new home. A new crypt. But... Ah! Wagon wheel! Damnedest wagon wheel! It broke. Don't you see? Oh, 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 yes! <laughs> yes, the kindly stranger can certainly help. Go to the farm, the Lorius farm, just over there, off the road. Talk to Lorius. He has tools. He can help me. But he won't. He refuses. Ah, convince Lorius to fix my wheel. Do that, and poor Cicero will reward you with coin. Gleamy, shiny coin! Oh, for the love of Mara, what now? That Cicero feller? <laughs> Tell me something I don't know. Crazy fool's already asked me about five times. Seems he's not satisfied with my answer. Why can't he just leave us alone? Pay me? You think this is about money? Have you seen the man? He's completely out of his head. A jester here in Skyrim? Ain't been a merry man in these parts for a hundred years. And he's transporting some giant box. Says it's a coffin, and he's going to bury his mother. Mother, my eye. He could have anything in there. War contraband, weapons, skooma. No way I'm getting involved in any of that. What? And just who in Mara's name are you, anyway? Hmm? Come here, telling me my business. And for what? To help a, a, a fool? Look, I... I... Yes, you're right, you're right. Feller might be nutters, might not. But fact is, he needs help. I turn him away. What kind of a man am I, huh? Look, um... Thanks. And I'm sorry for my unneighborly reaction. If you talk to Cicero... You be sure to tell him I'll be down to help soon. So happy, so jubilant and ecstatic, but more, even more, my mother thanks you. Here, here for your troubles, shiny, clicky gold. A few coins for your kind deed, and thank you, thank you again. <laughs> Oh, 
to the ground with your blood. You have committed crimes against Skyrim and her people. What say you in your defense? Smart man. Now come along to the castle. We'll take any stolen goods, and you'll be free to go. After you pay the fine, of course. <laughs>